bonjour. I'm Professor Wesley, and I'm the director of our Paris program. And um, the first uh, myth that I would like to dispel is that um, <coughs> that you do you do not have to know French in order to participate in the Paris program. Um, <coughs> although it always helps. And in fact, there are some um, free language classes that are being offered here on Tulane campus for those who might be interested in getting some, some basic French under their belt before participating. But again, it's, it's truly not necessary, just as with Amsterdam, um, most people um, will speak English. Um, <clears throat> the Paris program um, is focused this year on trade and globalization. We have uh, the incoming chief judge of the uh, Court of International Trade who will be teaching a course on international trade. We will also be offering courses on antitrust and merger and on European Union law and law, culture, and society in a globalized world. So it's a very rich program, and I encourage you, if you're interested, to go to our website and take a look at uh, some of the courses and the, the faculty who will be teaching in Paris this summer. Um, I also would like to take this moment to uh, introduce my assistant who's here, Elizabeth Adams. Uh, Elizabeth is, um, is one of the former participants in the Paris program, so she could certainly give you a perspective on Paris um, from, uh, <coughs> that uh, a student might have. She's also uh, been working as my assistant for the past couple of years. Uh, she's a native uh, fr uh, French speaker, and um, she also participated in uh, our internship program. Um, one of the nice aspects of, of going to the Paris program is that we do provide internships with local law firms. Uh, these are unpaid internships, but they are great for experience. And, um, <clears throat> and some of the experiences are actually uh, quite nice. Um, uh, one of the law firms that uh, participates in our internship program is located in a 17th century palace. So um, it can be quite luxurious from that perspective. Uh, I don't have to really, I don't think, sell Paris to you. I mean, Paris is the city of lights. It's one of uh, the major cultural centers of the world. And it has um, things like the Louvre Museum, um, which uh, and Versailles, which we try to organize uh, social events for the students so that you it 's not all work you have uh, some play and every year, I take the students on a boat ride on the Seine River so uh, Paris is a quite exciting program and a quite exciting city and if you are at all interested, I encourage you. To, um, to come and speak to me or come and speak to Elizabeth about it um, or any of our former students who participated in the program. Thank you.